The summit, which is scheduled for the 31st of July to the 1st of August, is to identify opportunities for economic recovery and mass employment creation by leveraging private sector capital. The summit is the first of its kind and will bring together regional, international and the local private sector players, the civil society and organized labor. The event is aimed at reviving the Namibian economy, attract one billion U.S. dollars worth of investments over the next two years, identify and remove growth-slowing policy impediments, and promote Namibia as a competitive investment and tourism destination. We expect that at the summit there will be some public sector commitments art articulating policy stands on issues that have been clouded by policy uncertainty, and further announcement of private sector investments about 500 million US dollars over the next 12 months. The chairman of the high level panel on the Namibian economy, Johannes Gavakap, said there will also be plenary sessions which will be underpinned by unleashing Namibia's natural resources, leveraging public private partnerships to revive the economy, affordable housing, manufacturing energy and leveraging economic growth from regional integration, among others. You know, consensus among Namibians, everybody has got his own way thinking about what we need to do, but this conference is going to try and help us to, to get consensus around that. And the next one is going to be housing, how we can mobilize funding for housing. You'll recall that we had this mass housing program, but we haven't thought through how we're going to fund this. What we are trying to do this time different is Yes, we have got a shortage of about, NHE is telling us they've got 92,000 houses shortage, and anything between 300 and 500, that's a stock deficit for housing in the country. How do we fund those? So we hope to come up with some ideas about how we need to fund those. Gavakab also added that the summit is mostly to help the country in weeding out corruption. I need to probably say that not everyone wants any problem be solved. Those people who benefit from a crisis will resist the solutions that we are trying to come up with. You know, even we, before we started, many people say, you know, there's a lot of issues that people raise. Just give us a chance and see what we do this time around. The summit, which will be dominated by Namibians, is expected to be officiated by President Dr. Hage Gengop. For Business Today, 